Hey, what's going on, guys? Nick here from Bushwookie Airsoft, and today I'll be doing an unusual review of my German broom handle. Um, this is in no means a quality gun. Um, I literally got this at a dollar store that I stopped at one time. Um, when I was, when we were on the road going somewhere, I don't remember where, but, and I saw this and I was like, you know what, how cool would it be to have this gun? So, I picked it up, um, it's pretty nice, actually, for, I, for the, due to the fact that I got it at like a Dollar General, or whatever you call those things, it, it's pretty nice. I'm not quite sure if it's metal or pol polymer, I originally thought it was metal, but I I decided it's polymer now. It just, it's cold like metal, but it's definitely not. It, it feels like polymer. So, it's a heavy polymer, so that impressed me. Um, the mags are just a cheap plastic. Um, it has a sight thing. It's like a fake sight, adjust, sight adjuster. It's cheap plastic, fake hammer cheap plastic um the site it's actually crooked um sorry about that i you might be able to hear matt scream matt sorry about that he's playing with the dog but anyway um the site is actually a little crooked it doesn't mess with the shooting but it is a little crooked but you know that's the consequences of buying your gun from a dollar store um, the reason I wanted to do a review on this is, I don't really use it much, but I thought it was pretty cool, like, I mean, not many people have a German, like, broom handle like this, I don't, say, I'm not saying it's very rare, but I'm not saying it's, like, average to see one of these out in the field, but, anyway, so, I don't, it shoots, uh, it's a spring pistol, so it doesn't shoot too bad hard, and plus, it's from the dollar store, so, yeah. And I keep bringing that up, because it's a, it's a cheap gun. I got it for, like, $10, maybe. Which, really, I mean, if you're getting a starter pistol, that's pretty good for a starter pistol, starter spring, I guess. But it's still, it, it's still uh, a cheap dollar store gun, when it all boils down. Oops. Anyway. Um... Anyway, it shoots, I'd say, uh, I don't really know how far it shoots. I'll do a shooting test to exactly see how far it shoots. Um, it doesn't hit too hard. It hits a little hard. Like, Matt has shot me point-blank range with it. I mean, it leaves a little well. Matt! Sorry about that. Um, it, he shot me from point-blank range. He usually uses it. I don't, I've never used it really he uses it when he feels like playing uh with me and my friends um that's i mean that's much as i could say about it like i said polymer uh fake wood by the way it's got a little thing if you want to hook it on to a bell or something um like i said shooting test in the future and oh by the way it came with two mags i was impressed about that Longer mag right here and a shorter mag. The shorter mag I like a little better because it makes it a little more compact. You can move it a little better. I mean, with this, uh, with the longer mag, it's more kind of a hassle, I think, to when you're like, uh, I mean, it's not really a hassle, but it's different than a normal pistol. Like, you, you're not used to having like a mag stick out like that for pistols. That's why I do like, I mean, the shorter one, it holds, like, I think the shorter one holds five, five BBs, maybe, possibly seven. I'll show that on the shooting test, too. And this one holds, I believe, I counted 15 one time. So, it holds decent amount, I think. Decent amount of rounds. Um, yeah, but that's pretty much it about this gun. Uh, I'd like to thank you guys for watching, 
and I will hope to uh, see you guys at the shooting test. Um, please subscribe and rate the video. It lets me know that you enjoyed this little fun review. And other than that, see you guys later. Bye.